So today I'm deciding to try out the mouse. This giant behemoth coming in at 188 tons. I mean, I don't know why the Germans thought it'd be a great idea to make uh, a tank this just humongously large. There was <laughs> genuinely no need for it, but yeah, let's just take it into battle. Now, um, to say my experience in the mouse is um, a bit of a mixed bag. Maybe you could say it's a skill issue. I mean, probably is just a skill issue at using this thing. But then again, when you get up here, yeah, it just kind of sucks. There's also a um, hello mouse somewhere. These types of maps, I'm not the biggest fan of this one. Just because there's so many angles, you can just get sniped at, and there's not really much you can do about it. Uh, hello, hello Conqueror. By the time we get to the middle of the map, I feel like the match is going to be over. The guy is certainly uh, taking on the challenge. <laughs> this Conqueror has been with me the entire time. Uh, can I see anyone? Yeah. I think sitting on this little corner bit is going to be a pretty decent spot, but... I mean, we have a lot of armor, so... Ah, there is someone behind there. And, you see... I've never really been good at leading my shot. Let's just, uh, back off for a minute. I mean... We got his... Breach. Uh, but he's just gonna walk away. Yeah! Oh, hello, hello. Uh, what are you? Is that an IS3? Oh, God. What are you doing now? Hello? Uh, you know, I never really tried using the 75 millimeter properly. He is charging into battle. <laughs> okay, goodbye. <laughs> oh, he's got my secondary gun. Am I just blind? It's really bad I did just wake up like 10 minutes ago. Oh, my fellow Conqueror has been with me this entire time. I appreciate you. Um, well, there goes his turret ring. Unfortunately, I don't play at this tier enough to know where all the weak spots of the tanks are. Uh, I probably should play at 7.7 more. Well, this isn't even 7.7, this is a down tier. Oh, he's pushing. <laughs> bye bye, my good sir. I haven't really managed to move anywhere, but I suppose you can't really move anywhere in this giant behemoth. Okay. He is moving up. You, you've just been with me the entire match, haven't you? Ah! You know what? This is risky, but I just want to make a move now. Oh dear. That is not good. Uh, well. Uh, uh, well, I mean, he cracked me. Not ideal. I know there's someone down there. I really hope he pushes up. Oh, oh no. No! My, my, my fellow conqueror. No. Oh, there you are. I mean, there goes his barrel. But that isn't all I wanted to aim for. Now I don't know with a super pushing like most tanks I've just uh, spoken about recently where to actually pen them. Now this is a skill issue on my part although I don't know what his repair time is going to be. He's, he's probably going to get his barrel back by the time I get over to him. Um, or I might Good be dead. Good morning Vietnam! Please, please oh. <laughs> no. I imagine this tank will be coming back as an event vehicle at some point. I imagine around Gaijin's birthday. Uh, once again. Now I only managed to get it last year, from what I remember. 
because um, I mean, despite playing this game for years, I never made it far enough in the German tech tree to actually put any research points into the mouse. But... Oh, these stairs! Yeah, I'm surprised. Oh, uh, hello. Please turn. Please turn. Please turn. That is not good. Hello. Um, that is very not good. I did not realize he was there. Uh, this has become quite the conundrum. Uh, well there goes my secondary weapon as well. Now, this is a matter of, I mean, they're both T-44, so they should theoretically kill me any moment now. This is, this, this is not looking good. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is literally fucking me at this point. I'm going to reverse and kill you, please. <laughs> uh, that is quite funny. And he's dead as well. Um, oh dear, I forgot about the guy behind me. Please. Please, sir. I think this is the end, although that was quite funny. Yeah. It was worth it. I feel like when it comes to playing the mouse though, you got to play it with the intention that you're not going to do great in it. Because you are unfortunately in a situation where when you do get up tiered, you're most likely going to get wrecked. I haven't seen the mouse in real life since I think the um, the one that the Russians uh, recovered on World War II was placed in a museum in Moscow. However, I have seen the King Tiger in person and uh, it is incredibly large. Hello, P55. Uh, I really messed up, didn't I? <laughs> Worst mistake ever. Or, oh, you know what? That's all paid off. Although I am down to two crew members. And I'm about to get flanked, not free. I really don't know the limits of um, overextending in this game. I get too greedy most of the time. Uh, that is an ATGM. Thank you for shooting me. Although I am now down to three crew members. I love how no one's actually gone for the point. Oh, speaking of which, although initially no one actually went for the point, everyone just fights in that top left corner. Oh, there goes that guy. Uh, there is... Oh my... It is another Conqueror. Unfortunately, my reload rate is... Uh, <laughs> How did I... <laughs> I was not expecting to get him with the heat shell. <laughs> you know, that worked better than I initially intended it to. Oh dear. <laughs> um, okay. I underestimate the 75mm gun on this thing. I can hear something. Is that another Conqueror? Did you? No, I kind of put myself in a slightly precarious situation. I mean, I feel like he's not going to push either, though. I'm going to try and go this way, unless he's already had the same idea. He knows. He knows. 
I think someone finally got him. Yeah. Um, I can't. I'm so bad at shooting through brick walls. Come on. Uh, and I should, probably should have taken the shot. I just, I just can't judge them. Maybe I should just take the shots more often. Now, we can play as the ultimate anchor, as the mouse. Uh, that is from behind. Nice. Oh dear. Oh no, there he is! I forgot about you! Oh no. Oh dear. Ah, uh, that's a shame. And that is the mouse. Well, it certainly has armor going for it as a strength, including a very powerful 128mm cannon and a 75mm cannon to compensate between the reloads. I mean, its weaknesses such as slow turret traverse speed and speed itself being one of the biggest hindrances for the tank. Uh, I mean, tanks and light tanks can flank it pretty easily. Although it's still very formidable in a down tier, with many tanks not being able to penetrate its thick armor. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one.